Colin Yoakum. I'm the boys soccer coach here at Saginaw High School. Mm -hmm. I've been here since uh, 2010, so seven years, going on eight, and pretty successful uh, seasons that we've had here since I've been here. Okay. Some good things have, have happened, so we're going to try to continue that. Okay. And, and tell us a little bit about your athletes that you brought with us. Oh, this is this is Juan Revelo, and this is Blayton Jack, and this is Jose Flores. Okay, Juan is a sophomore, played uh, center forward for us. Blayton, senior, um, played in the back at the beginning of the season, and played up front at the end of the season. And then Jose Flores, uh, sophomore, played in the middle, played in the midfield. Okay, now Juan or one, right? Yes. Okay, so sorry about that. So tell me a little bit about your position as my soccer IQ is not that high. So uh, tell me. Center forward is more like uh, you, it's yourself basically because you're on top by yourself and you're basically just waiting to get the ball and your job is just to score for the team. Your job or is to score? Either okay. score or make opportunities for other players. Okay. Yeah, your job is mostly just to score for the team. Okay, and what about you, Blade? Um, I played right wing back, so mm -hmm. it was mainly defending and playing in the middle and just creating opportunities. I usually um, would get the ball past me down the sideline and try to um, cross it. So you're the more aggressive player then. <laughs> okay, and what about you, Hussle? Uh My position is uh, center mid, mm -hmm. and in my opinion, center mid is the hardest position to play in soccer. Why so? Uh, you have to have a, a lot of vision to see where you're going to pass the ball. And one play could, could cause you a goal, and one play could make a goal happen, so. Okay, okay. Now, um, you want to talk a little bit about maybe some of the highlights for you this season? Uh, we had a, well, I had a couple highlights. Um, many assists from Jose. Uh, Alito, I think it was a 30-yarder, 30 30-yarder. 30 uh, I didn't even, I don't know. Coach says I, when I don't think and I shoot, I score great goals. and. I think he's proven that. Uh, yeah, I scored a 30-yarder at Alito. I don't know how I did it. Mm -hmm. it I just shot <laughs> in the moment. Uh, last game, Chisholm, I scored a bicycle kick. What, what about you, Blayton? What My you personal say? highlight would be like, I have a high vertical mm -hmm. when I went like go for headers. So it's just like, it's crazy when I'm like eye to eye to like some six and a half foot players. Yeah. Like against the other team or just like winning headers by just jumping, standing, you know, not, not running, but just jumping up. Right, and, right. Um, I think I'm scoring my only goal this year against Northwest. Okay, and you? Uh, for my personal highlight, uh, I think uh, it was against Boswell. Mm -hmm. uh, I think it was, in my opinion, the best game I played this season. Uh, we ended up winning in penalties. We didn't. We tied 0-0, so we went to penalties, and uh, I don't really have. Yeah, that. I think I remember seeing the video clip going around social media of you guys celebrating that yeah. win. Yeah. So that was a pretty fun win. Yeah, it was. Yeah, it, was it was a big game. Would you think? Would you guys say that was the highlight game for the team, or what was the highlight game for you guys? Uh. No, I think it would be against Boston. Yeah, you think so? Was that was probably one of them. One yeah, of. one of them. But uh, you guys won the preseason, uh, preseason tournament. Oh, oh that was yeah. in Stephenville preseason okay. tournament. Okay, in Stephenville. Yes. Nice. Had some good goals in that tournament. Yeah. But really well. Beat Granbury in the finals. Uh, that helped kick on our streak of wins at the beginning of the year. Yes, it did. And we had the, had the big win and uh, penalties at Brewer, right? First. That was big too, wasn't it? So there's, there's some good ones. Okay. Now, you are a senior. You're the only senior of the group, correct? Of oh, just this group right here. Yeah, right, right, right. Of, of, yes. Yeah. So um, do you plan to attend college anywhere? Uh, I plan to attend uh, UTA, but after high school, I'm going to go to the Air Force Reserves and then um, study at UTA, try to major in aerospace, and then once I get my bachelor's, I'm going to go to the Air Force again as an officer. Okay, that's awesome. Congrats on Thank that. You. Now, I always like to ask my senior athletes, how do you feel athletics has helped you prepare for the next phase in your life? Um, responsibility and maturity. Help you prioritize things, yeah. 
No, uh, that, that's important. That's important. Now, you guys, y'all are sophomores, correct? Yes. Okay. How are you guys going to prepare in the off season to go further next year in district? I feel like, well, we're kind of already preparing now. The coaches are, like, working, working us out to the best of our ability. I mean, like, they're literally getting every sweat gland out of our body. <laughs> but, yeah, um, we're working out pretty hard. Hopefully next year we'll make playoffs and make something good. Okay. Uh, I just Thanks. I just think we all need to work together and work hard. Every every day we have the opportunity to work out, and you know what they say, you know, hard work pays off. That's true, and athletics does teach you that, and it carries over into life. That's what you know the seniors usually take away from it. What do, What do you think, Coach? Well, the boys are working hard right now in the off season for sure. Mm -hmm. We're gonna miss the seniors after this, you know, after uh, this year. It was a it was a good year. But uh, moving on and, and trying to work towards the next year, the, mm -hmm. we've already set up the off-season program, as the boys were talking about, um, strength training, speed, and mm -hmm. technique on the ball, control of the ball. And so quite a few, quite a few days are, are uh, pretty stressful for them. And then on the Fridays, we generally get to play. Yeah. 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 So That's a little right. relief and see if we can um, see if we've improved any over that period of time. So okay. it's been good so far. Well, very good. Well, looking forward to success for you guys next Thank next you. year. Thank you all for joining me. Thank you. Perfect timing. Perfect timing. <laughs>